Happy Thanksgiving, and welcome to Tom and Jerry on Super Nintendo. I actually had this game as a teenager when I got, shortly after I got my Super Nintendo. Because when I got my Super Nintendo for Christmas of 93, the games I got with it were Super High Impact and Super Street Fighter 2, but then my sister and I took all our old NES games to the video game store, cashed them in to buy a game, and this is the one we picked out. So it's been quite a while since I played this game. So he can't run, that's how the faster he can go. I don't know what those green things are. I remember collecting cheese chunks in this game, I don't remember the green thing so much. Kind of a regular platformer game. These weapons don't work very good. <laughs> they go at an angle. So they're kind of useless. They look like cheese balls. Cool, hit some. Pretty simple stage. Movie theaters stated this. Is, oh no! Wait, I don't. I don't think this. There's one of them where you're on like a skateboard or something like that. Okay, yeah, that must be the next stage. I thought I remembered collecting actual che like they look like slices of cheese. Cool. And so that's kind of, whoa, it's kind of tricky right there. Okay, how do I get up there? Maybe I gotta get a good. No, that still doesn't work. Oh, there's the cheese chunks I remember collecting up there. Ah, oh cool, you can jump on the bad guys too. You know, I should have done a video the other day. I just realized yesterday that 
look, going through my like dates and stuff, I realized that the GameCube came out on the 18th of November. It's now the 24th. If I would have known that before the 18th, I would have done a video. It would have been my first ever video on a GameCube game. Because now I ha actually have the GameCube and one game. I have Super Mario Kart or Mario Kart Double Dash. I have... Oh! Okay, I don't know if that was good or bad. Okay, that was good. I wasn't sure if I fell backwards towards the beginning of the level or towards the end, closer to the end. Anyway, the 18th would have been a perfect day to do that GameCube game, but I might do it sometime this weekend. I got a four day weekend. So I do have time. So yeah, this is the one, yep. You're on like a skateboard, but it's actually a movie ticket. Popcorn, you don't I don't have any weapons. Oh, someone stuck them to the floor. What is that? Like a dust bunny or something? Oh, it, it is a dust bunny and to make it even funnier, it turns it in, stops and becomes an actual bunny. Someone dropped three rolls of popcorn. Oh yeah, I remember this part. I think there's a boss at the, the end of this level. I cannot remember how far I got in this game, not very far. Not sure if I ever beat this level or not. Can't remember how many times I'm supposed to hit him. Oh. Idiot. See, there there's really no strategy because you can't see the thing coming, it's just kind of luck. I beat him. See a fool? Okay, so we go on to the next round and we got a big old boot. Yeah, I think I remember this level too. Oh, I got like an extra health meter. Kind of like a Zelda. I Somehow I knew those were going to fall. I guess I just... Something or... Whoa! So, something I barely remember. It's probably been 20 years since I played this game. What is that anyway? Oh, my God. 
These weapons are so useless. That's kind of cool. Can't say much for this music, it's really not very good. Okay, there's like nasty infestation of roaches in this game. They're like the size of almost the size of a mouse. information on this game. Guys, I forgot to do so before. So it was released in 93, developed by Rydell Software Productions and published by High Tech Expressions, the same ones that published MLBPA and one of the NHL games. If not two, maybe. So the Y button and A button and X button all throw. Oh cool, so I did not realize you can actually control your throws. A and X throw it straight and Y like an overhead throw. Got boogers dropping on you. Whoa. That makes it much easier. I vaguely remember this, so I got this far. Whoa. Oh. That was kind of nasty. So like disproportioned everything is. You got bugs that are half the size of a mouse. You got a apple cores that are like smaller than the mouse's ear, and the size of the mouse's ear. Imagine a roach and a mouse being bigger than an apple core. That was an awfully small turkey leg, too. Oh, 
Whoa. Ah. Okay. Ground. like really not that fun. It's kind of too easy. There's really not much to say about it. Kind of basic kids game. Yeah, I remember this too. Oh, cool. Oh, great, I can't even touch it. I beat him already? I think that was easier than the first boss stage. Yeah, I remember this one too. Maybe I get further in this game than I thought I did. The graphics are pretty cool in this one. Oh. Oh, you idiot. There's like a slight delay before throwing the second cheese ball. So you gotta hold the jump button down to really bounce on this thing. That was nasty. I got five lives. I don't know if I'm gonna do a, that long of a video with all my lives. Ah, oh! Now that's not fair. Oh. What killed me? The bottom of the TV screen? I didn't know TV screens were deadly to mice. land on him, but I missed him. See, that one is almost like impossible to avoid. Supposed to, oh, I bet you I'm supposed to jump and bounce off that rocket. So yeah, the level game is pretty easy at first, and then it gets suddenly gets hard. Imagine playing Super Mario three, and you go from like level two to level eight. Maybe level two to level six. Okay, that didn't work either. Is that the end of the game? Maybe they made it so you can't pet get any further than that. Oh, 
Watch. Watch. Okay, now I'm like really failing. That was close. Looks like this is going to be the furthest I'm going to get. This is probably the furthest I got when I was younger, too. Oh, I ducked! That was nasty. It's like a delayed re reaction. That rocket, I, I think I hit that one every single time. Idiot. Well, it's a pretty fun game up until this point, and it's not fun anymore. And my battery lights flashing already after only 20 minutes. Eventually, get to a point where you just don't care anymore. This is why I don't get very far in games because I just don't have the patience to keep seeing this exact same scene over and over again. Like all those games that I can beat, like all those Mario games, it took me years before I finally beat one of them. Because every time I would play them, I'd slowly advance a little bit further, get sick of dying, and then I'd quit the game next time I'd play it, start at the beginning, so. Anyway, that was Tom Jerry. Hope you enjoyed it up into that extremely difficult stage. I'll see you in the next video, which I'm thinking will probably be, probably be the GameCube game, Mario Kart Double Dash, so. See you in the next video. Happy Thanksgiving Day.